Okay, the lights just went on about 50 seconds ago. This is what the corals look like. And I'll do an update. And we're back. It's later on in the same day. The corals have mostly woken up. So the egg cans and the bottom corals corals won't look much different. A little fluffier maybe. As you can see the hairy mushroom is pretty big. Cloves are coming along nice, gorgeous corals. Kind of like little daisies. Red mushrooms, red mushrooms, and more red mushrooms. Blah, blah, blah. Now, this Montipora, every time I look at it, it upsets me. So I'm thinking about ripping it off and chucking the whole dang thing. We'll see. Green stars doing good. Waving hand, I might get rid of the waving hand. We'll see. As you can see that candy cane in the back there is splitting. And there's a uh, new growth coming out of the stem there. You see those little spiny things? I think those are new stems. Which is kind of cool. I don't know what's going on. This pack of zoos, zoos uh, I don't know what happened yesterday, but they're all shriveled up. They're all pissed off. Don't know what happened. So maybe I'll take them out and clean them up a bit or something. Give them some TLC. Or I'll just chuck them out because I couldn't be bothered with those ones. They haven't grown since I got them. Kind of hard to see the, the new heads on the frog spawn. That's about it. A little bit of an update. Some growth. Coraline's coming along. And yeah. Uh, look for a new 90 gallon video soon. I've done quite a bit of work on it and maybe I'll put that up at the same time as this one anyway enjoy comments questions welcome bye bye okay another addition to this video is I had a viewer ask how did I safeguard or water guard the new style of hoods from Walmart because they're a little tricky compared to the old ones uh, what I did is I cut a piece of acrylic um, about the size of the hood and then what I did is I bent it. I used a, a plumber's torch and I bent it. It's hard to see because it's clear. So there's a bend there. And so it was a, a rectangle with a bend so it kind of looked like an L. And then what I did is, is if you see the, the edges here are kind of uh, tapered. So I just took a grinder and I made a cut in the acrylic so it'll kind of mold itself to the taper comes along here cut out a little notch for that comes along another taper and that's about it um, so it doesn't span the full thing oh and a little notch for the cord but then you plop it on and you, or you silicone down and then put it on that and it works well it's hard to see because it's clear of course but that's what I did the new style of hoods. Anyway, hope this works for you. Enjoy.